Hey guys, even here with the old school abs and we got some new info, some juicy stuff again on Sean Ray versus Dexter Jackson, a rivalry, I guess we can call it that way, I guess it is a rivalry. So, uh, two days ago I made a video, I compared these two guys basically, I gave you my opinion on the whole situation and if you haven't watched the video go ahead and watch it, but what is that interesting thing that happened? So we posted this uh, video on uh, old school abs Instagram profile and Sean Ray actually responded with this comment. So he shared an interesting photo of Dexter Jackson right here, obviously an older photo of him, and another photo of himself. In both photos these guys are looking impressive, but what he said was no contest, and this is important, fake Cass. And this is very interesting, so back in the day during the 90s, he accused Flex Wheeler of having implants in his cows. And he wanted to get Flex tested, but what kind of test can you do for that? He wanted him to be x-ray tested to do an x-ray on his calves to see if he actually has implants or if that is really muscle. That was very interesting, but this time around he did not say that Dexter has implants, he just said fake calves. So what that means is that uh, he is not certain that it is implants, he could be implying that Dexter is using Sintel, or that he used a lot of Sintel or any kind of sight enhancement oil at that point because Obviously his calves are looking insanely huge right here and they are nowhere near this size today. So do I think that he had implants in his calves? I do not think so. If he had them then he got them out, but I think it was just oil because something was definitely odd. He doesn't have calves like this today and they don't look normal right here. So it's definitely something like some kind of oil. And I'm, I'm pretty sure because uh, Milos Sharchev also took a lot of oil and stuffed it in his calves and a couple of other body parts too and it looked exactly this way. And now there is nothing left. That's the thing with these oils, they go away, they disappear, they just get dissolved into the muscle or the bloodstream, I'm not really sure how it works, but it just disappears. It's not like implants, implants don't go away, it's plastic, it stays there. So it was obviously some kind of oil, is that really a big knock on Dexter's physique? I mean, do judges really care about what your calves are looking like? I think they don't care at all, and I think that's why Dexter didn't try hard to maintain this kind of calf size later on in his career, because it's pretty much irrelevant. Maybe it was more important during the 90s, but today it's not, today it's definitely not. So I don't think this is really a big argument, but I would agree with, with Sean. These cows right here definitely do look fake, whatever that meant. I never noticed it, but now I can see it based on this photo. If this is even a real photo, this is not a photoshopped photo, but it, it looks weird for sure. If Dexter wants to make this clear, he's very welcome to do so on our channel. Anyways, the next thing that was following this conversation with Sean Ray was this. So we asked Sean if he wants to come to do an interview with us. But he says, no, I'm not fanning the flames, just stating the truth. He is going through midlife crisis. <laughs> I'm not interested in winning an argument of opinion. I'm three against zero versus Daxter. I'm not in high school trying to compare dick sizes. <laughs> He's clearly got ego issues. I'll remain silent. Thanks. Huh. So, apparently Sean didn't want to do an interview and uh, he's gonna stay silent but he didn't exactly stay silent based on this uh, this message right here and of course I wouldn't be sharing this with you guys on YouTube if we didn't ask him if it is okay so we asked him and this was his response yes that's fine just add as an athlete I've always respected Dexter's career and longevity I've just never understood his obsession to try and continue to compare or compete with me 19 years into my retirement? The record is clear, Sean Ray 3 versus Dexter Jackson 0. Ho <laughs> ho, shots fired once again. So obviously Sean did not stay silent as he says that he's going to. He said a couple of things and some of them are quite, quite juicy. So based on this, I mean, let's just put this argument, put this whole um, comparison into bed with this video unless Dexter makes a reply to this, but that's probably not gonna happen. This is probably gonna be the last video on this channel about these two guys, of course, unless something interesting happens, but as for now, that's gonna be it. So, guys, I mean, tell me what do you think? Do you think Dexter's cows are really fake? Do you think that uh, Sean Ray is actually a better bodybuilder because he has three wins over Dexter? 
But then again, we have Dexter who says that uh, he was robbed, basically. That the reason why Sean beat him was because of his established name. And the judges had him just higher, higher than Dexter. And also that was the beginning of Dexter's career and he peaked much later. And he gained 30 pounds over, over that weight while he was competing against Sean. So that will be definitely noticeable in the comparison rounds. And that was basically what I said in my previous video about his whole situation. But go ahead and watch it if you haven't. And then again, if uh, Dexter's scales were fake, like implants or something like that, that could hurt him, definitely. But unless we don't really know for a fact, it doesn't really matter, does it? Well, whatever you guys think, let me know down below in the comment section. You got these exclusive comments of Sean Ray right here on this channel. So guys, please subscribe for more bodybuilding videos like this. If you enjoyed this video, however, like it. And thank you so much, guys, for watching this video. All the best and don't forget to keep it old school.